You know, it's the latest effort to cut crime in the Queen City. Today, Chief Blackwell unveiled the newest strategy for the 90-day plan that we've been watching very closely for you. It includes adding 30 more officers to patrol units in the targeted areas that he's mentioned to us. Also, that's on top of 620 officers who already patrol the streets right now. We are staying on top of this story for you tonight. Our Zach Pitts is on your side with what led city leaders to make these changes. Good evening to you. We are closing in on the 90 day mark of the plan. Right now, the focus is on more police visibility. Now, simply put, more officers are going to be on the streets. In fact, 30 officers are being reassigned from what they're doing right now, and they'll be put on patrol. Their focus will be on the neighborhoods that have seen a recent uptick in crime, primarily districts two and four. Chief Blackwell says the plan is working, but as he told our own Craig McKee, there is still much more work to be done. Since June, the department has made nearly 100 arrests and taken nine guns off the streets. When it comes to manpower, Chief Blackwell tells Nine on Your Side he'd like to bring the total number of people on the force to around the 1100 mark. And the next six months, he also hopes to have a shot spotter system in place. And that's basically a series of high tech microphones that will essentially pick up the instant a gun is fired and tell officers immediately where that shot came from. Now, on the completely other end of the spectrum, Mayor Cranley told us flat out the 90 day plan is not working. He says he stays awake at night thinking about how he can cut crime in the Queen City. City Manager Harry Black says he's always pushing for new strategies to keep the city safe. The key is making certain that I'm always asking the question, are we deploying adequate patrol resources on the streets to deal with crime in the most effective way possible? So I'm always challenging the department in that regard. Chief Blackwell says the department already beefed up its gang security, and he wants to make a point that this plan, it's not a solid plan. It's constantly evolving. But he says regardless, after this 90 days is over, the effort to cut crime here in the Queen City will not stop. Zach Pitts, 9 on your side.